Welcome back to all our listeners. Good to have you with us today. My name is Henrik Kalkjern and this is our third part in our mini-series that we are doing together with our guest Michael Tessarian. The uh, second segment, uh, our last program, we uh, left off talking briefly about something called the Mysterium. The uh, philosophical aspect, uh, both the journey and control in regards to Michael's research. And this is what we're going to go into in detail about in today's program. I, of course, urge you to go into our archive, listen to part one and two of this mini-series to get the full background. And as you probably know, Michael's website is michaeltessarium.com. That's Michael, T-S-A-R-I-O-M.com. And uh, again, just to mention this, that his research is extensive. It goes into many different areas. And uh, I suggest you use his site as a portal to go to the uh, individual sites to find out more about his work. Uh, so with that, welcome back to Red Eyes Radio again, Michael. Thanks, Henrik. Nice to be on. You know, last uh, show you brought up uh, Walden 2 by uh, B.F. Skinner. Uh, and you highlighted these very interesting quotes that you uh, sent me. One was from B.F. Skinner himself that kind of reveals his, uh, I guess, mentality regarding mankind uh, control as well. And basically, yeah, how mankind Skinner. is supposed to survive the future. Uh, the other one was from J.B. Watson, uh, who was an advisor to the advertising industry and an associate to Skinner. Part of the grocery store. Um, and he wrote uh, the, the following. Uh, it's theoretical goal is the prediction and control of so behavior. Body scooter, yeah. I actually the behaviors in this her, effort is that a unitary pounds. scheme of animal response recognize no individual line between man and brute. That's kind of revealing in regards to uh, his uh, relationship basically to man as well. And again, just to emphasize, he had a background in the advertising industry. Uh, and again, the second quote uh, that you found from B.F. Skinner, maybe you can read that for us, uh, and, and this reveals some of his mentality as well. Yeah, because it turned out that uh, he also was uh, had written a book called Beyond Freedom and Dignity. Uh, so, uh, worrisome title right there, Beyond Freedom and Dignity, but the, the line that uh, corresponds is, is, quote, in this chapter, actually this may be a partly a commentary on the book, and it's partly his quote. It says, in this chapter, Skinner argues that a technology, technology of behavior is possible, and that it can be used to help solve currently pressing human situations such as overpopulation and warfare. And the quote from Skinner is, almost all major problems involve human behavior, and they cannot be solved by physical or biological technology alone. What is needed is a technology of human behavior. Wow, how about that? Now, what, maybe again you can just mention, what is the relationship between J.B. 